Bashir announced that Jim's funerals and weddings are impacted as well. Governor Bashir stated that gyms can only be at 33% capacity. People working out must wear a mask at all times now as well. Now this is a huge hit to locally owned gyms in Bowling Green with the new year quickly approaching. Peak season for gym membership is in January and local gym owner Manny Pennon says the limited capacity and mask mandate may slow down his business once again. We are getting, we are seeing that uh, it's hurting us. It, it, it is hurting us, you know. But like I said, I mean, it could have been worse. You know, they could have shut us down as well. And, and you know, we're just small business owners out here. Just, you know, this is for a bunch of us. This is just, this is our, so this is all we got. Another mandate, Bashir announced Wednesday, no indoor gatherings of more than 25 people in a room. Now that includes weddings and funerals. Many brides who have had all, to already push their weddings back may have to significantly cut their guest list at the last minute. And for funerals, watching families mourn without many of their loved ones is a hard thing for Warren County Coroner Kevin Kirby to see. I look at it that is that, that you don't have the closure that you would normally have by having a service and being there and viewing the, the person and being with your fa other family members that you just don't have that quite that, ex that closure that you would have if you did have a regular service. So some of the family members aren't going to have that closure. Uh, I think it's hard on family. All of Wednesday's mandates go into effect on Friday at 5 p.m. As of now, the mandate is expected to end on Sunday, December 13th at midnight.